Esteban Ocon is going to be a Grand Prix winner in Formula One. Ocon wins the Hungarian Grand Prix. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> yes, guys. He just won the Hungarian Grand Prix. Well done, mate. What a moment, ah, it's, uh, it feels so good. Esteban Ocon, Grand Prix winner. <laughs> Sounds good. Huh? Sounds pretty good, doesn't it? How does yeah. it feel? Uh, you know, we were joking with the team that, uh, you know, last year we finished second, obviously, and the next good place, you know, to get would have been the, the win, uh, but we are not expecting it today. Uh, clearly not. Uh, it's my favourite track, one of my favourites, as I always say, and. To make it here, it's, it's extra special. It's lights out and away we go. And there's Lando Norris touch. And into each other goes Valtteri Bottas and Sergio Perez. Hamilton leads. Esteban Ocon is right up there. And yeah, unlucky, the first start. There were more people uh, even uh, unluckier than me because uh, they had to, to retire to something. But uh, I lost a lot of positions being on the outside uh, this afternoon. So you clear the, the start, you get away unscathed. When you see Lewis goes round and you pet, you're in the lead. Yes. Like, what's going through your mind? <laughs> Crazy. I mean, yeah, I mean, I saw Lewis not pitted and I was like, oh, are we doing the right thing? You know, because Lewis is usually taking the right decisions. And, um, and we saw clearly that the track was dry. Is he going to dive into the pit lane? No, he's not. But Esteban Ocon is. Ocon's making the choice to come in for tyres and his crew are ready for him with a medium compound tyre to come on. So Ocon from second is going to make a stop. Hamilton's going to be the only one who's going to start this race. And uh, it's hard to go in the pits when you are, you know, in second place. You know, you want to kind of you know, keep, keep that one for you and go on the grid and start because, um, yeah, that would have been risky, but actually it was, it was the right thing to do. We discussed with the team, very well managed on all that. The start with just Lewis out there. And honestly, we had this thought, you know, with P2, should we just take the start and, you know, just stay P2? But it was clear that the track was, was dry. OK, Esteban, you are leading the Grand Prix. Let's go. Copy that. Um, and yeah, we hold off Sebastian, who was, uh, who was uh, quite quick that race. Uh, I mean, I'm completely dead uh, energy-wise, but uh, yeah, what a race. The race is on now to the chequered flag, and Vettel is not going to give this up because he's on warmer tyres. Ocon's looking in his mirrors, wondering where Vettel is. He's right behind him, can't find a way through at turn four. Wow, that was closer than I would have thought. You controlled that race as if you'd done it a hundred times, but I'm guessing that in your stomach, things were, you know, you were just ten. Yeah, you have to kind of forget that you're in the lead for a moment. I tell you, uh, there's a few times that my front wheel started to under-rotate, you know, I was like, <gasps> you know, don't do that, because I only have a two-tenths margin, you know, over Seb. If he gets into the RS, you know, he overtakes me. So, yeah, it was, it was quite a stressful moment, but I tell you, it's kind of easier when you're in the front. <laughs> Fernando is, you know, he's just proved his class. I think the other thing that's amazing with Fernando, he's read re races. He knew he was for position for him potentially, but he knew he was helping the team. Hamilton trying to go around the outside here in a turn two. Does break later this time, not late enough. Alonso stays ahead, but this is going to carry on and on because don't forget the pace advantage that Mercedes has towards turn four. This time he's on one side, and I think they might have touched there as well. Alonso somehow is keeping Hamilton at bay. This is incredible. Put your heart in your mouth as they were getting towards turn four. Then. Yeah, but Alonso, I mean, what a Brilliant defensive drive uh, he's doing today, isn't it? The top five is the best result of the year for me. Winning the race for the team is the best result ever. And uh, we have some kind of history in this track, you know, winning in Renault in 2003 and now winning as Alpine uh, in 2021. So you're giving Esteban a massive bear hug. Like, it's such a, a great thing for him to achieve his first Grand Prix win. Yeah, it was... Uh, I mean, it is a special day, you know. He will never forget this day. So I'm, I'm so happy for him. You know, as a, as a renamed team, you know, Alpine, and uh, maybe looking forward to the future and, uh, and maybe repeat the success of the past. Uh, this, this kind of boost on, on motivation is, is huge. So, and now we all go with a smile on our face. So I'm, la I'm happy for them. Yeah, the, the, the first win for, for the Renault Group comeback, first win for Alpine. So, yeah, Alele Bleu. <laughs>